Hi, Matthew with F Class Community Channel here. Uh, first match of the year uh, at Mission Rod and Gun Club. And uh, heading to the butts right now, uh, going to give the first test of the F Class Panda action uh, at a, a competition. Uh, so far, the groups have been okay. The verticals uh, very tight. Uh, we're into probably a, an eighth uh, or a quarter uh, MOA at uh, a vertical at 200 uh, meters. So uh, hopefully it'll get me on paper and uh, I'll be able to uh, score uh, well today. However, it'll be a test of the brass uh, and the system that I set up, and that's what really it is uh, in the first, first match. I'm finding that you know, some groups are maybe a little inconsistent. However, it, it is a pe period of time of adjustment for me uh, with this new rifle. I'm finding a few things uh, that I notice with the, the rifle in terms of how it sets up. One of, one of the things is I have to change my hand position for my uh, bag rider. The bag rider is being round, um, and I'm uh, it, it using a, a more of a pistol grip from from AR. I'm finding that when it recoils, my hand hits part of the stock or bumps up uh, uh, against uh, something else. So uh, you know, positionally, I have to make make some changes. Uh, the when it recoils, what I notice is the 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 pistol grip for the stock runs back uh, towards my hand if I'm cupping and squeezing my bag. So. Uh, you know, just a little, a few things, you know, and some, some ergonomic things about the stock uh, in terms of when, you know, where the teeth are in relation to the pistol grip. Uh, when it recoils, sometimes it, it digs into my thumb. So, at any rate, uh, this is a, a first competition here at the Mission Rod and Gun Club. And uh, looking forward to com competing with uh, all the competitors here. Uh, meeting some uh, old old faces again, and uh, a lot of new faces this year. So that's great for the sport. Um, and uh, you know, uh, I'm introducing uh, a friend to F class as well. So you know, that, that's one one of the exciting things uh, that that I enjoy to do is introducing new people and helping new people uh, get the rifles into position and and set up for for the first shoot. So that will lead me into another project that I'll be working on. Uh, for the F-Class Community Channel. Uh, so stay tuned uh, for some further updates and uh, how, uh, how this uh, competition is going to go. Hi, Matthew with F-Class Community Channel. Well, it's the end of the day. I <laughs> was too consumed with uh, shooting uh, my matches and scoring and uh, uh, helping out with uh, in the butts to uh, remember to hit the record button on my uh, relays. However, uh, it seems to be uh, it, the day's over. Uh, I shot two good, two good rounds. Uh, I shot a 71 uh, and uh, nine, 74 and three or four or something like that, and 74 and seven. So there's some consistency. There definitely the load development has helped in finding with OCW um, uh, finding a load. Uh, it's holding waterline really well. Um, I got uh, more consistently more V's than. I did before with my Savage rifle, um, so I'm, I'm happy with that. Uh, today wasn't an uh, ultra windy day, so it was a good test of, of the rifle's precision in terms of elevation and holding elevation. Uh, there are a few pieces of brass that are, are uh, in question that uh, when I shot, I know I held really well on, on, on the uh, target. However, uh, the outcome was uh, a 4, which uh, irks me a little bit, but uh, that's shooting for you. So I'm going to go back, test those pieces of brass, see if the, the brass is a little bit slightly different. However, it's, it's something that uh, e every shooter will, will encounter. And this is how you kind of really ultimately weed out uh, uh, and remove variables from shooting. Um, so uh, we'll, we'll take it back and do some analysis. Uh, I, I don't know the scores. Uh, it posted it up. Uh, it should be pretty tight there's a lot of good competition this year this fantastic fun uh, and it was talking to uh, some uh, old faces and some new faces as well so uh, I'll post the final results uh, in uh, I'll throw in uh, a still uh, of the final results and we'll see where we go from there and uh, maybe the award ceremony if I place <laughs> any rate Matthew with F class community channel 
uh, just wanted to bring you a little bit uh, more of the Mission Rod and Gun Club uh, championship here uh, uh, at 300 yards. It's a fantastic range, uh, beautiful day. Uh, I couldn't ask for more to shoot with good friends. So remember, keep an eye on the flags and tight groups.